I haven't had a single fail with this routine, so I thought it would be a good one to film and share with you guys. So to start off, I've washed and conditioned my hair. If you're interested in what I used to wash and condition, it was the Superdrug Extracts Coconut Water Shampoo and Conditioner. Absolutely love those. Almost finished the bottle of shampoo and I'll definitely be rebuying both of those. Really inexpensive as well. And Superdrug if you're in the UK. So I washed and conditioned with those and I literally just brushed through my hair after I squished and conditioned with the conditioner. I just brushed the top up and the bottom down with my Curl Keeper Flexi Brush. And so I've already got some nice clumps going on and it's unfortunately been air drying while I've been getting changed um, I do want my hair to be wetter so I'm going to get my spray bottle so I've just got my continuous spray bottle this one's from Bounce Curl I'm just going to re-wet it a little bit because um, it was absolutely dripping wet and it was slapping me in the face and I was getting soaking as I was trying to get dressed but now it has dried a little bit so I'm just going to add a little bit more water and the first product in this magical lineup is Curl Keeper Original. And so if you've been subscribed to me for a while, following me on various channels, you'll know that this has been one of my favorites for years, literally. If you go back to my different uh, favorites videos, this always appears in every single one. It's amazing. Curl Keeper Original Liquid Styler, and it literally is a liquid. Um, so it is, a, I suppose, like a, a liquid gel. Um, but I wouldn't say it has a lot of hold. It's, I always categorize it as a curl enhancer, but it is amazing and it always just gives me the clumpiest of clumps. And I feel like it's one of the most underrated curly products in the whole curly community. I think it's absolutely amazing. So I just sort of smoothed that through and then used praying hands to distribute it well. One of the things I love about this is it's very difficult to use too much. You can be really generous with it and it never, ever, ever makes my hair feel producty at all. You can really be generous. So just praying hands through all my hair. And then the second step in this routine is the Curlsmith Invincible Volume Mousse. So I've probably used this every wash day since I got it. Um, when did it come out? It came out at some point this year, I think, maybe the beginning of the year. Um, and oh, it's just so good, I love it. It is very concentrated as all Curlsmith products are and I really don't use very much. Um, if you've tried it and not gotten on well with it, I would say try again, but use less than you think you need. So that's about all the mousse that I'll use for my whole hair. It's a very sort of creamy mousse. Um, just, my hair just absolutely loves it and it definitely gives good volume, but I also find it gives good hold. And I like to apply mousse by patting it over like this initially to just sort of try and get it spread throughout the hair so it doesn't all end up in one place. Just smoothing it over. and then I'll start scrunching. And I like to flip my head in every direction when I'm um, scrunching my products and applying my products because it helps you to make sure that you get every last bit of your hair, but it also gives a bit of root lift because you're flipping your roots different directions so they don't get sort of stuck laying down in one direction. I'm also just loosening my roots with my fingers. At this point, don't be tempted to add more mousse. It's definitely tempting, but from experience, I just don't need it. But what I do do as my last step is add a hairspray as a final styler just for a little bit more hold. And I use either of these two, the Curl Smith Flawless Finish or the Buclem Flexible Hold Hairspray. Either works really well. Um, I'm gonna go with the Buclem today. And I just spray it over my hair. Smells so good. It's got a really herbal smell, which if you know any of the Buclem stylers, they all have a beautiful sort of floral herbal smell. And then a final scrunch. Now we're going to diffuse. How easy was that? So I'm going to diffuse with my Leaf and Swift hair dryer. Had to move us because the one thing that annoys me about the Leaf is it doesn't have the longest of cords, so I had to move uh, my stand a little bit. But this 
I just have to say, I don't think I talk about enough how much I love this leaf and hair dryer. I have this and I have the Dyson because the Dyson was bought for me years ago as a gift by my husband. But since I've had the leaf in, I pretty much use this every single time. It is every bit as good as the Dyson and actually there's a few features about it which I love even more. Like if you press and hold the power button, you get like a rotation of heat. It goes cold, medium, hot, cold, medium, hot. And I love that setting. It's just so good, it dries my hair so fast. So let's go ahead and diffuse. I'm just gonna show a few clips of diffusing because my very next video that is coming up is that my full diffusing routine. So I did film the entire thing of me diffusing and that will be its own video coming very, very soon. So be sure to switch on notifications so you don't miss it. So this is how it looks directly after diffusing. I'm gonna give it a good fluff. and then just let it sort of settle into place. I'm gonna give it a little while to settle, put on my makeup, and then I'll come back and show you how it's sitting. So I've let my hair settle, put my makeup on, and I've just given it another fluff, and this is what we have. And again, as always with this combination, I am so happy with the results. Let's do a, a full spin for you. It just works without fail every single time. So I hope there was something helpful in that, that you found something useful or enjoyable. And um, I will link the products in the description along with all my various discount codes. So if you're in the, in the market for some new products, you might find a discount code there that will help you. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.